Hey, yo, what is up, YouTube? It's Jordan Heed, back to watch more. It's always sunny in Philadelphia. This is season one. This is season six, episode one. Uh, yeah, man, can't believe it's season six. Moving on, moving on, moving on. It's moving kind of quick. I know, like I said earlier, you know, I'm still like a third of the way through the series. Uh, there's 15 seasons, so we got that going. Uh, have had a eight. This show has been fucking amazing, man. I mean, the views are great on YouTube. It's fucking hilarious. I love everybody that watches this shit with me because they're just like, they, they, I feel like y'all just don't give a, I mean, you guys give a fuck, but it's, this kind of comedy, it, it bodes well with you all and it bodes well with me. Like, this shit is fucking hilarious. And if anybody, like, gets all PC about this shit, they need some fucking help, man. Cancel culture is fucking annoying, man. This shit is, this shit is just, it's, it's, it's like a virus, I feel like. Everybody's getting fucking canceled and shit. Shit's annoying as fuck. I mean, some people deserve it. Don't get me wrong. But some, I feel like nowadays, we, we's on like a witch hunt. with like comedians and people just can't say what they want to say. Uh, man, I was watching this TikTok the other day where like this dude was, he was a comedian and like he was just getting heckled because this lady didn't think it was okay her that he, that he speak on black people. And like his comments... I can see how they were offensive, but they were comedic, and I didn't think they were racist at all. And I know sometimes it's like, it's up to like the viewer on how they feel about it, you know what I mean? But I feel like sometimes like the viewers just go way too into the rabbit hole to not understand the actual context of what the comedian is trying to put out there. And I feel like that's the case with this show too, because some of the shit that's on here, man, is just, boy, do they go there. But like, if you actually see the context of where they're going with it, it's, 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 it's fucking amazing. Like, they're, they're really good at it, of, of, of hitting on these very, very taboo, taboo fucking subjects, making fun of it, but not being, like, terrible. Like, they're not, they're not offending anybody, in my opinion. It's just, it's just good quality fun, and they make fun of everybody, so it's, it's great. Either way, season six, episode one, let's get this done. Yeah, let's get this going. If you guys would please just take a second to either comment, like, subscribe, hit the bell notifica for notifications. It really helps out my channel. Uh, the uncut and early access to this will be available on Patreon. Thank you all for watching. Let's get this thing going. I'm not trying to jam you up. I just don't believe you. What is not to believe? I am absolutely Dennis Reynolds. Yeah. This picture looks nothing like you. Yeah. Well, thank you. Nothing. Because I or get out. Mac? Yeah. Oh. Hey. Oh. Tranny. Carmen. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. How you doing? She looks wow, you look amazing. Great. Sweet camel toe. No, it's good. It, it, it's actually gone. <laughs> I, I had the surgery. Get out! Oh, wow. That's fantastic. Jack, I would like you to meet my husband, Nick. Oh, wow. Husband, you're married. <laughs> It'd be like that, bro. Are you serious? What the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? Jesus. Ooh, Bodie, this is gonna be one of those ones, huh? All right, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. I'm here. I'm all the way here for this one. Let's go. Is he trying to fight gay marriage because he wants to get with Carmen? No, wait wow. A second. So I went down to the gym this morning, right? I was all amped up because Charlie and I found a bunch of nuts. Also, I'm out of breath. What in God's name are you <laughs> talking about? Yeah, what's, yeah, no. explain. I ran into the tranny. She got her dick cut off, and she married a dude. It's not great. No? That is a gay marriage. <laughs> uh, I got a question for you. One's a girl, one's a guy. Yeah. And how is that gay? Yeah. Her husband is a homosexual, okay? Why are you making that assumption? Because he's with the tranny? You are with the tranny. What are you, Charlie? That is completely different, and you know it. Yeah, no, he's right. That's different. Because this new guy, if I'm hearing correctly, he waited until she got her dick cut off before he banged her. Oh, jeez. Means... Hey, who gives a shit if gays want to be miserable like everybody else? <laughs> Let him do it. Exactly. Off my ass. That's two dudes banging each other. What do you get from that? Nothing. Nothing. Uh, that is a persuasive argument. You should take your powerful extension cord argument straight to the Supreme Court. Mm -hmm, they'll love it there. Run there yeah, run the they'll love it. This is and Mac, dude, look, I think you great. just get upset that the tranny married some guy that's not you, and that's what this is about. Yep. No, no. I'm with Charlie. Yeah, he's getting himself all worked yeah. up, huh? Yeah, very worked up, very worked up. You know, I always thought I'd be married by now. Same. What? Shit. Thinking about myself and, and my situation, and 
I guess I always thought I'd be married by now. Yeah, I feel you on that, buddy. What the shit are you talking exactly. about? Exactly. Frank, I'm talking about Maureen Ponderosa. Oh, my God, Who dude. the Don't fuck is Maureen you. Ponderosa? Maureen Ponderosa? Remember her dead tooth, dude. What? Dead tooth? She didn't have a dead tooth. You guys remember her brother, Bill? Bill Ponderosa? Ponderosa, Jesus. Damn. Damn, that's Damn. a lot of pennies. <laughs> Oh, Frank, I gotta go see a chiropractor. Yeah, don't don't right. see a chiropractor, right. man. Ain't, ain't not. Bills, right? Is that it? Oh, I oh, 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 my back. And then they got each other's backs. Oh, All right. this is gonna sound oh crazy. God. <laughs> you know that domestic partnership thing that gay guys can do? I can totally get on your health insurance. You wouldn't even have to pay for the chiropractor. You about to go this route? You proposed it to me. <laughs> Come on, man. No, I'm saying. Aren't you have father friends, and son? Right? Uh, let's be friends with benefits, right? Oh, oh yeah. Geez. Two by four. I got too much pain. It's bad on me, too. Oh, All right, I got Give you. Me. I got Give you. Me. I got you. Jeez. Look at me. Come on. Who's this? Is this your husband? Uh, oh. This is Bill. Hey, guys. Bill? No. Wow. <laughs> he's uh, Shel wow. he's Sheldon's right. dad from uh, Young Sheldon. God damn, this has been a really fun walk down memory lane. Uh, Maureen, great to see you. And Bill, take care of yourself. Or Who's that whatever. actress? I've seen her before in many okay. other things. Okay. She's always me? like, I mean, she's pretty. She's like well, uh, weird girl or whatever. I don't know. Uh, hey, how was your dad? Dad died last year. Oh, wow. Did he die? Yeah. Oh, that's, that's too bad. It happens, you know. He was getting up there, right? It's probably natural causes or Jeez. suicide. Oh, what the Cars fuck? I had to break the window of the dots. Oh, yeah. And Max gonna be, Dennis is gonna be like, let's not talk about this. Okay. Let's go on to something different. Oh, wow, wow. Maureen Ponderosa. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dennis Reynolds and Maureen Ponderosa back together again at last. Oh, God. He's gonna fucking drop her like a sack of potatoes. He's the worst. Damn. Men with men committing indecent acts, sex in the butt, will receive the due penalty for their perversion. When a man strikes his slave with a rod so hard that the slave dies, he shall be punished. If, however, the slave survives for a day or two, he is not to be punished for the slave is his property. That's that's not what I'm talking oh, about. Oh, wow. That's, a different, that's, that's good. That's oh, good. So you say for as long as you like, and as long as I get up after a day or two, we all good. That's what you're telling me? No, I wouldn't whoop Ooh! Uh, Which doesn't really pertain anyway, because oh, that oh, section sorry. is not from the same time. Oh, oh, really? Oh, what yeah. your section from? Exactly. Now? I'm not a gay man. Yes, you are. You're banging a dude. Look, if anything, you're the one that slept with me when I was a man. <laughs> He's so <laughs> Oh, that's it. You get it. No, 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 this no, is about no, you and no, me. No. <laughs> this is great. This is great. Oh, come on. I mean, him? <laughs> Instead, you called this soft body and you gay married him. And now you're calling me gay, telling me I'm tripping. You and are, though. Confuse me with your liberal biblicisms. Man, <laughs> my guess is you've been confused for We're a very long time. time. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is just hilarious, dude. Much. I love it. I All fucking right, love dude. it. Okay, I admit. All right, well, what's going to happen <laughs> when you go on life support, dude? Dennis and Dee are going to pull the plug on you so fast, your head is going to spin. But think about this, Frank. You know who's not going to do that? <laughs> right here. This thing. We're married. Maureen and I got married. What is wrong with you? Yeah. That's not what's wrong with me, Frank. It's what's right with me, and that's this little piece of paper oh, right God. here that we just signed. It's our marriage <laughs> certificate. Now we're married. Boom. Wait, hold on a second. Hey, you just had to sign a little piece of paper? <laughs> they gave Frank and I like a million floors for our marriage. Hey, go ahead. Oh, my God. What is the matter with him? Did yeah, you smell Dennis. Breath? Are you kidding me? Yeah. It smelled like she was nibbling on little pieces of shit. Is that what's wrong with her? Wait a second. Wait a second. Dennis. I am having, this is crazy, but I'm having feelings again. It, like like some kind of 14-year-old kid or something. I mean, you remember feelings. Oh, right? God. Feelings? Yeah. I have feelings every you single day of my life. Do you? <laughs> you have feelings? <laughs> well, I'm saying, I need you to move out. Whoop! Like now, like right away. Why are you doing this to him? He's already <laughs> dealing with a lot. Uh, act out it's not your apartment because you never signed the lease, if you recall, because your credit was so bad. You know what? Believe it or not, I've been doing some inventory, and it turns out you don't actually own anything in this apartment. Yeah, yeah. Every single thing in here is mine. 
Uh, for instance, that shirt that you're wearing right now. I threw it in the trash, and then you fished it out of the trash, and you got the sleeves off. But I did have to drop you from my cell phone's family plan. <laughs> this is like a bad breakup. Something yeah, totally. He just broke up with the man. He literally just broke up with the man and kicked him out. That shit's fucking hilarious. Oh, there we go. Oh, God. That's better. Why do you people keep bothering me at the gym? I'm so sorry. It's going to be a quick question, Charlie. Yeah, for real. Me, right? Charlie and I, we're going to get married. Who would be the man and who would be the woman in that situation? Oh, jeez. Neither of you would be the woman. You're both men. Are you kidding me? Is, is this what you've been upset about the whole time? Which one of us is going to be the woman? I'm not going to get my dick cut off and sold to China, spend the rest of my life on a treadmill like this guy. What are you even... What? Are, what? <laughs> we would both be men. We'd be two cool, straight hey, dudes, dudes <laughs> together. <laughs> Ooh. Well, I never thought of it that way. <laughs> two dudes. Okay, I'm... Let's not argue on this or think about it too much. Huh. Let's just do Two it. Cool, married dudes. dudes. Two dudes. Not gay. Well, I'm down with that. All right. Down with that. Gay dudes. Gay dudes hey, did they really sell your dick to China? No. Oh, I can tell by your. They probably did. Who knows? I don't know. You come barging in here like that. What are you doing? Okay, look. It takes a big man she to admit She slept with me, Ponderosa. Right, I was wrong. Everybody look should at her. get married to whoever they want, which got me thinking about you and me. Oh, no. I'm not going to marry you if that's where this is headed. You did in real life. Okay, then what are you doing here? I'm glad you asked. I'm moving in. Also, I need to get on your gym membership. No. Oh, what are you doing? Are you going to throw up? No. So why are you gagging? I got to throw up. I'm going to no, throw no, up. No, 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 oh, no, no, not in there. Oh. oh. Sorry. Uh, no, Ponderosa. Oh, God. He cheated on his wife with her. She's like all for it. You don't give no fucks. You get sweatshirts that you <laughs> seem so fond of. Yeah, and you've glued some uh, some jewels and some flowers and things to it. Uh, Fucking weird. I like to be comfy and current. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah, this I is... did not remember that about you. You don't remember a lot of things, silly. Hey, I love you. Oh, uh, the dead tooth. I see it. The dead tooth. Ugh. Fucking marriage is so scary, dude. Yeah. Oh, God. Is that it for the episode? I was kind of shocked on that one. I was kind of really, really shocked on that one. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, man, <laughs> okay. There's so much to unpack on this episode, man. This shit was great. First off, uh, Mac trying to uh, fight gay marriage. Fucking hilarious. It's like... Again, I think I said this earlier, man. They just really do good with these, like, taboo fucking, uh... They're not, like, gay, you know... Gay marriage is not a taboo concept, but, like, people's opinion on it is just is just so fucking, like, out there. And, you know, my personal opinion is, I guess, the same thing that D shared. is like, yo, if you want to get... If you love somebody, get married to them, bro. Fuck it, you know? And, like, be miserable, too, as I would say. Because it's like... You know, people should have the right to be with whoever they want to be with, you know. But to say that, that being stuck with someone for the rest of your life isn't sometimes an internal damnation of hell. I mean, who knows? Fuck. You're looking at someone, you know, that's... Ah, shit, I thought I was going to be married by now, but fuck, did life fucking put a whirlwind on that fucking plan. But they did it, but life did it in good, in good taste, though, man, because... If anything, fam, I feel like I dodged a bullet in my case. You know what I mean? And sometimes, bro, marriage ain't for everybody, bro. Like, you know, like, real talk. Like, would you rather fucking, you know, have you lose your own mind or have someone lose your mind for you? You feel me? Like, to, you know, like, and marriage is work. I must say marriage. Look, look at my family, my parents. My parents have been married for, like, over, like, 36, 30. Yeah, they've been married forever. I mean, don't get me wrong, man. Like, sometimes I'd be looking at my dad and be like, dad, like. You all right? <laughs> you know? <laughs> like, but that's, that's, it, it, that's what it is, you know? And, like, I don't know. I guess as I've become older, I've realized, like, you know, the concept of marriage, something that you thought, like, is, like, the way to go when we were kids is the way to go. But it really isn't, man. Like, a lot of people don't get married, bro. They, you know, they'd rather be fucking alone, you know? Shit, they adopt. It's, it's, it's a thing. Uh, it's fucking, you know, it's just, it's just life, you know? What I'm trying to get out of what I'm trying to say is, bro, it's better to, it's be, you don't want to get partnered with someone that's going to fuck you. I mean, they, they, I mean, obviously, partner with someone that's going to fuck you, but I mean, like, really, really, like, 
screw you over in like life and shit. Don't do that, you know. And that ain't the way to go, you know. And don't get married for fucking beneficial purposes and shit like that. That is just I don't ooh, that yeah. Whew. You know, the idea of marriage is it's a it's a it's a very crazy thing to think about, bro. Sticking with someone for the rest of your life, like that's a big one. That's a huge one. But hey, some motherfuckers do that shit, you know. Uh shit, my parents are like right now actively trying to get me fucking it, that's a situation in general where I'm just like, yeah, I don't have nothing to do with it, you know? I don't want to, sh- like, I, I, just could, I just couldn't imagine, like, doing what Dennis did. Just met someone that you haven't seen. You know what I mean? Get married. And then, like, start realizing, oh, God, this is, like, forever. Like, this isn't, oh, my God, <laughs> you know? I, I just see the sense of just terrible, of just a fear in, in Dennis's eyes towards the end of that episode when he was just like, oh, God, what have I done? Um, Dennis, uh, Dennis kicking out Mac. Just, I feel so tragic for Mac. It, just, it sucks, you know? He's basically just like, oh, dude, by the way, everything in this house is mine. Nothing is really yours. You know, you're just kind of here. I took you off the fucking phone. It's just classic breakup shit. It just, yeah. <laughs> You know, if 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 Mac was having sex with Dennis, he would have definitely been a homosexual. Like I've no no way of not having that as what he would be a homosexual. But hey, I mean they're buds, I guess. You know, <laughs> you know. Um, and the last thing that we need to talk about in this episode definitely would be Bill Ponderosa cheating on his wife with a uh, D. You know. Cheating is wrong, fam. You know, no, you know, don't cheat on, don't cheat on your significant other, fam. You know what I mean? That shit ain't right. If you gonna cheat, you know, make sure y'all broken up. I mean, if you're gonna, if you want to get with someone else, don't. I take that back. Don't cheat. Is what I'm trying to say. But if you have the urge to be with another human being that is not your significant other, fucking communicate with your significant other, and either break it up and go do it, or just don't do it. <laughs> You know, just like, let's just, let's just be real, right? You know what I mean, film? Uh, but, yeah, man, Bill Ponderosa, bro. He used to be Sheldon's, I mean, it's Sheldon's dad and young Sheldon, but fucking slamming D. I don't know if he's lucky or unlucky. I mean, shit, I wish I was him, I'll be honest. Uh, but, all right, yeah, good, hey, good beginning to the new season. I'm liking it. I'm loving it. I've always loved the show for what it does. It's just like, it's just classic, just hilarity the whole entire time. So, uh, yeah, on to the next episode. We're going to get get this thing going. So, again, appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Thank y'all for watching Mimi's World back here. I got all this before I leave my reactions. Please take care of yourself. Man, we'll see you on the next one. Peace!